I got really interested in my current course when I was in secondary school and an engineering company actually came to my school and spoke a bit about what they do and that got me really interested in engineering so then I sort of came and had a look around different universities and that made me really decide this is the course I wanted to do. I really liked about my course that we touched every single aspect of um, automotive design. Um, so where, whether that be engine and powertrain, whether that be body and chassis engineering, brakes, cooling, we kind of did a bit of everything. And then on top of that, we also went into more numerical and science-based theory behind those. So you've kind of got your practical engineering skills, but you've also got your more deep dive technical knowledge as well. Being a woman in engineering is, is kind of intimidating because it is very male dominated but it's great because a lot of like for example on my placement year I got to meet a lot more women in engineering and that sort of gave me more confidence that I could get a job in engineering. I finished my A-levels and I didn't really know what I wanted to do. Um, I knew I had a passion for cars and I didn't originally know that automotive engineering was a thing so I was just going to do generic mechanical engineering but once I saw that I could specialise in automotive engineering and I could kind of follow my passion in that way then it kind of seemed like a no-brainer. So my lecturers supported me by if I had any questions about assignments or coursework they would answer pretty much straight away and they were really great at explaining things to you whenever you wanted. I would definitely recommend this course to people and I'd definitely recommend they apply for it especially with the sandwich placement because you learn all of your basic principles and then you can go and apply them in industry and then come back for your final year with all that experience and apply that in your studies and your final year projects.